Hello and welcome to another BeamNG tutorial. Today I'm gonna show you a really useful mod for BeamNG called the Grip Editor UI app. It lets you change how much grip different surfaces have, like pavement, dirt, or ice while you're actually in the game. No restarts, no digging through files. It's great if you want to play around with traction. Maybe you want to make a snowy road, or test how your car handles with super grippy tires. It's also just fun to mess with if you like crashing cars or simulating weird driving conditions. Alright, before we dive into the features, here's how to install the mod. Go to Mods, then Repository the search for Grip. Subscribe to this mod that I am showing here. Once you did this, now go to UI Apps menu. Click on Edit Apps, then add Apps and search for Grip. Double-click the mod to add it to the current UI. You can move or resize it anywhere. It brings up a simple panel with grip settings that you can change in real time. At the top, there's a button called Get Surface that auto-detects whatever surface your car's on so if you're on asphalt or dirt, it pulls up the grip values for that. Or, if you want, you can just pick a surface manually from the list. As you can see for each surface, we have a lot of parameters that we can modify. You can hover over the question mark sign, and it will explain you what it does. If you don't want to dig too deep and just have fun, I suggest you do as I show in this video. Select the all surfaces, and just increase the static friction. This will increase the grip of the tires to the road, making the car very grippy. As you can see, now the tires are not slipping at all, and you brake much better than before. But the catch is that it will also affect the grip of any part of the car that might be bottoming out. This can help you do insane wheelies with drag cars, and also climb to places where it wouldn't be possible before. If you ever mess something up, you can reset just that one surface, or hit reset all to bring everything back to normal. And don't stress none of the changes are permanent. Once you restart the map, it all goes back to default anyway. Some cool ideas, lower the grip to simulate ice, raise it to create grippy racetracks, or just go crazy and see how your car handles in weird conditions. It's perfect for testing, tuning, or just making gameplay more interesting.